assalamu alaikum in this tutorial we are going to retrieve all the folders of device storage containing video files now i am going to resume the adapter work here on bind view holder method that is called by recycler view to display data on specified position here we have to set text on folder name folder path and number of files call holder dot first one will be folder name dot set text we have to set text on folder name first create int value index path is equal to folder path dot get position dot last index of slash here this last index of will return the index of substring that is on last occurrence let's suppose we have a path slash storage slash media slash videos here this last index of will return a slash that is on last occurrence in this path this slash is on last occurrence that is return and save in index path variable now we have to create a string name of folder folder path dot get position dot substring index index path this variable plus one this slash value is saved in this index path and here on substring index path plus one means this slash value plus one it will return this folder name and we are setting the folder name here name of folder here we have to set the path dot folder dot folder path dot set text folder path dot get position it will return the path of folder and the last is holder dot number of files dot set text we are setting static text for now five videos and here below we have to set click listener on item view holder dot item view dot set on click listener new on click listener when user will click on folder item it will navigate user to next activity using intent intent new intent context we have to create next activity here right click on it select empty activity rename it as video files video files activity click on finish our activity is created set this activity in intent here video files activity dot class intent dot put extra we have to send the folder name we have to send this variable name of folder here and on the last context dot start activity intent and here we have to set the size folder path dot size now we are going to initialize the adapter in recycler view open main activity private 
first of all we have to create array list variables array list pass media files media files new array list control shift enter below the media files we have to create one more array list of string type name it as all folder list new array list control shift enter here create recycler view object control shift enter and create video folder adapter object name it as adapter now below this if statement you have to allocate memory to recycler view using id recycler view is equal to find view by id r dot id dot folder underscore rv control shift enter and here we have to initialize the method show folder point on this press alt enter create this method here we are going to initialize the adapter adapter is equal to new video folder adapter first variable will be media files second all folder list and give the context this control shift enter now set this adapter to recycler view dot set adapter adapter recycler view dot set layout manager new linear layout manager pass the context this orientation will be vertical and reversal layout will be false reverse layout will be false down here adapter dot notify data set change here before initializing the adapter we have to take the media files equals to fetch media that will return all the videos sorry that will return all the folders create fetch media method below this show folder method public of a list type fetch media here create array list media files name it as media files array list equals to new array list control shift enter create uri media store dot video dot media dot external content uri control shift enter now we have to create the cursor that contains the result set of query made against a database cursor variable will be cursor get content resolver dot query pass here uri and set all the remaining strings as null control shift enter below the cursor we have to create if statement if cursor not equals to null and cursor dot move to next 
control shift enter here if cursor is not equals to null means cursor have data then we are going to get all the strings here we will use do while loop you might know do while loop is used to execute a block of statement until the given condition is true create do create all the strings here string first variable will be id equals to cursor dot get string cursor dot get column index media store dot video dot media dot here we have to set the id but before setting the id we are going to create all the strings here press ctrl d until you got seven variables here we have to change all the variables here name it to title name this to display name size duration path and the last one will be rate added here set the values here underscore id title display name size duration and on the path we have to set data this data and the last one will be date added and here we have to create the media object media files object here we are going to pass all the strings here id title display name size duration path and date edit control shift enter here we have to keep the order of these variables same to the order of variables in media files model class here first one id title display name keep the order id title display name and last one is date edit and now below this we have to set the folder path to all folder to all folder list variable that we have created here create here int index equals to path this path this path contains the complete path of video file with extension path dot last index of slash create string substring equals to path dot substring zero to index this substring will return the path of folder without the file name that is in extension it will return only the folder path here we are going to create if statement if not all folder list dot contains substring control shift enter then we are going to add the substring in all folder list dot add substring control shift enter now below statement media files array list dot add media files now we have to create while loop while cursor dot move to next control shift enter and on the last we have to return media files array list control shift enter type colon here before building the app we have to change the color of app 
open values color change this color code copy this color code paste here here and also here now let's run the app and now our app is installed open it here you can see all the folders are showing here here you can see the three dots are showing because the path exceed the two line limit and three dots are showing due to ellipse size attribute if i click on any item it will navigate to video files activity so that's all for this tutorial we will continue working on getting video files in specific folder in next tutorial until then allah hafiz